Hello and welcome to the tutorial on addition. In this tutorial we will learn how to add two digit numbers and ones using the vertical format. Now we have introduced the vertical format previously so I'm sure you know how it looks. Let's work through our first example. Let's start with a nice easy one. Right, that is our question. It is 42, notice the sign, it is plus 42 plus 7. Now, how are we going to do this? Now, I'm sure you know this, and it's very simple, but we're going to go through this methodically and systematically. We're going to go through the process. First, let's label the columns. On the right-hand side, we've got units, U for units. The one on its left is T, T for tens. And where do we start the addition? We always start, always, always start with the column on the right. I'm going to circle it here in yellow. That is always our starting point. So we've got 2 plus 7. 2 plus 7 is the same as 7 plus 2. What is 7 plus 2? The answer is 9. So we've done that. The next part is we do the tens. Now I'm going to circle it. I don't need to circle it, but I'll do it anyway. We've got here number four, but we've got nothing down here. So the answer is four. Four plus zero is four. And there we have it. Forty-two plus seven is forty-nine. That was very simple. Now let's have a look at our second example. This time we have 55 plus 8. First things first, look at the sign. It is plus addition. Let's label the columns again. This time we have U for units and T for tens. And now we are ready to do the addition. Where do we start? We start with the column on the right hand side first. The units. 5 plus 8. 5 plus 8. Now you should know this from your mental arithmetic and what we've done in previous tutorials. 5 plus 8 is 13. 13. How do we write this down? Well, I'm sure you know this by now. We put 1 here and 3 here. 13. The 1 over here is part of the tens column. Okay, 13. So we've added the units. We are now going to add the tens. For the tens, we've got 5 here, 0 over here, but we have 1 here. So 5 plus 1 is 6. And that is our answer. 55 plus 8 is 63. Okay, we've got some space, so let's work through one more. This time we have 78 plus 9. 78 plus 9. Now, I just want to point something out. If you have a question which is written in the horizontal format, for example, C, and I'll just change colors to illustrate this. Let's say question C was this. 78, and it's written like this in the question. 78 plus 9. Okay. So, you can easily rewrite this into the vertical format as we've done here. The key thing to the vertical format is that you write it in nice, neat columns. That is critical. You have to write this in nice, neat columns. For example, 78 plus 9, the 8 and the 9 are in a, in a nice, neat column. Okay? If you do that, it makes it so much easier. Okay, we're not going to label or circle anything for this one. We're just going to go ahead and do the addition. So what is, and we're going to start on the right-hand side. We know it's a plus, 
8 plus 9. What is 8 plus 9? Okay, that's the units. 8 plus 9. Well, you should know this from your mental arithmetic. 8 plus 9 is... You can even do this. Double 8 plus 1. Double 8 is 16, plus 1 is 17. How do we write that down? We put 1 here and 7 over here. Okay, that's the units done. Now the tens. We've got seven tens. The 78, the number 78 has got seven tens plus this one over here. Seven plus one is eight. And there we have it. 78 plus nine is 87. And that is how we add two digit numbers and ones using the vertical format, which is also known as long addition.